Today's YouTube video is about now, not the coronavirus for once and for all. Um, so we'll take this off. <laughs> Today's YouTube video is about me talking about why I enjoy pain in regards to any aspect of life. I suppose if to scale it down, I was gonna talk about sport. Because that's where I, you know, I suppose indulge in pain mostly because that's what I do. It's what I'm supposed to I won't say it's my expertise because none of us are experts, but we will learn what we achieve every day in life. That's how I look at life. Um, but what I want to talk about is why I enjoy pain so much in life because I suppose from a young age, and that's this is me speaking from the heart, from a young age, a very young age, I learned about pain very quickly and I went through a lot of pain. And I'm not going to go into the ins and outs of it. Um, but does it stay with me? Does it stay with me forever? You bet it does. Um, have I brought it into different aspects of my life? Clearly, I have. Have I used it in different metaphors into sport, as in what I do today? Yes, I have. Um, I don't like a quick fix in life. I don't like an easy way in life. I don't like the easy path, as they call it, in life. I like to indulge. Like pain for me is just it's it's almost a a given in life it's, it's almost a you know I, I want to go through it for example at the moment and what i've been doing the past four years like ocean as you know if you follow me ocean swimming for me is a huge thing i really love it more so in the winter than more than so in the summer why because in the winter it's cold it's sub-zero temperatures it's freezing as i said it's just a different terrain altogether Whereas in the summer it's warm, it's relaxed, the sun is out, you're getting sunburns, you know, up to days. Again, it's an easier way of life. Whereas in the winter it's like you have to almost you have to most you have to almost build like a like a sheet of, you know, metal around you, mentally and physically, to kinda of go, Okay, you're getting in here to suffer. That's what I love about it. Why do I do Ironmans? Because they're long, enduring, pain, suffering, like there's no hiding place. Well there is, you can just go off your bike and walk off the course, but will I ever do that? No. Um like you're talking like 4K sea, sea swims, you're talking 180 kilometers on a bike, you're talking a full marathon, literally one after the other, bang, 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 one, two, three, and da da just log on and save money. That's what you're talking about. There's all that, there's these different aspects of just, I just love the pain. I done a, there's a race I done actually a few years, just under, yeah, two and a half years ago, it was a 24 hour time trial on a bike. Now, there was about, how many was there? 48 people done it, I remember. It was down at a toy, a toy, a toy, uh, down in Kildare. It was June 21st, the longest day of the year. By Jays, we needed it. Because you start at 12 o'clock on a Saturday morning in a laneway, and your man just blows a whistle and off you go, like, <laughs> grand sound. Um, and then you cycle for as long as you can in 24 hours in a 50k circuit. Now, you can stop for 10 hours, you can stop for 10 minutes, you can stop for 10 seconds. Whatever you want, no one cares. The objective is to see who can cycle the most in the 24 hour period wins the race. Simple, it's like maths two plus two equals exactly. So, what my plan was, or what I was doing was every every 50k, I was stopping for like six minutes, just literally putting the boot of your car, literally grabbing sandwiches out, putting them in your pocket, getting loads of food back on the bike, bang, 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 just keeping it going. Now, fast forward. You're 17 hours into this cycle. 17 hours. I was like, what? If a guard stopped me, he'd be like, are you locked? I'm like, ah, yeah, mate. Just cycling the past 17 hours. He'd be like, oh, you're very funny, aren't you? No, mate, I'm actually cycling the past 20. So, anyway, coming to the last three hours of the 24 hours. Now, I'm not joking. My back was aching. I was locked on the handlebar nearly. Like, literally falling asleep on it. Back was aching. I was in bed. So I was like cycling into a ditch. Do you know what I mean? What is... So... But I loved it. I was like, oh, this is amazing. Just that sense of pain, adrenaline, punishment. Um, and it, just all them little things in life have just brought me from, you know, literally from a young child into a young teenager into a young adult into where I am now, which I'm very thankful to be here today. And I've just progressed and progressed and progressed. And that's why I love doing what I do now. And that's why, you know, people are kind of wondering, like, why does he put himself too much pain? Like, I'm not saying I'm out every day, you know, putting a chainsaw to my head around, and I'm not, but you know what I mean? It's it's a good thing to have. It's a good aspect to have because it makes what you do a lot easier. It almost really hones in on what you're about. And I've really, I've took advantage from it because 
it does there's no doubt about it it really makes you go that extra i wouldn't say 10 percent. i'm talking 20 30 percent you know i've done all these races before as i said they're long endurance and the, the most easy thing to do is quit there's people there trying to put you down there's people there trying to you know you're not good enough or you even yourself can be saying like you know but you don't let it in you just keep going you keep going and going and going and going no one's stopping you no one is obviously there is one person stopping you and it's you so that's just a little snippet i just want to talk about that because i've been mean to talk about it for a while why i enjoy pain so much because pain should be an enjoyment and pain shouldn't be looked at a, as a you know a negative work on our pain jesus let's run away from that pain should be embraced in what way that's totally up to you you know we're all different and there is people that enjoy pain there's people that hate pain that's that's normal i'm not saying i'm just a deadly person or just expert going oh geez your man loves pain give him a plaque hold on give us one day will you nothing like that i'm just trying to explain like you know and people always look at that word oh, pain is like a suffering thing yeah of course it is but it can be suffering to make you a better person there's many elements to pain is what i'm trying to say again am i an expert no am i as i usually always say dr phil no i am who i am and i've got loads of experience of from as i said from a young age to where i am today so i suppose if other people can relate that give me a show it'd be great to talk about it because I love talking about pain. It's what I'm about. Um, but yeah, hope you enjoyed that. That was a good old uh, chat on the old chin wig.